um, you know, they're calling elections with only, you know, one, two, three, four, six percent of the votes already in. Um, so I'm really interested in to see just how the rest of the evening just continues to pan out as we see what the final counts are as we wait to see how Illinois goes. I know as of a few minutes ago, people were still standing in line. Polls were still open till eight in some places because they ran out of ballots. I know earlier today in Florida, there were reports that people left. I mean, the running out of ballots thing seems to have happened in several different places and is mm -hmm. highly problematic. Um, I just, I just don't understand how we're not prepared for these these situations and the potential outcome. Like how there's no backup. There's no you know, counter, but you know, there's nothing, it doesn't seem like there's anything in place, just like come back later. And for people who are maybe getting off work or trying to do it between jobs or whatever, like, <laughs> it's just like so problematic for it to be like, oh, come back later type of thing. So, um, yeah. so yeah, so it's interesting. And I know like Bernie Nation is like, oh my God, we really needed to win all these elections. And I know people were phone banking like mad, but the enthusiasm, it's not enough for us to be enthusiastic. Michigan was a great win, you know? Mm -hmm. but Michigan Michigan was clutch. Like, people yeah. were grinding on the ground. Like, yeah. um, I mentioned last week, Lena Danger um, from Detroit, like, she would update us regularly about she was doing literature drops. Like, but people want to win. I mean, we're up against one of the most powerful political families probably in the last 50 years of you know american history and if you want to win you and your local grassroots whoever you got we got to step it up we got to step it up and really do what needs to be done and fill in the gaps well let me ask you a question, can't be everywhere Go let ahead. me ask you a question what path let's say hillary clinton uh and and listen guys i'm just we're just discussing this so nobody panic nobody freak out nobody cuss me out on twitter but I want to ask a legitimate question. What path would Bernie Sanders have? I've heard people make the case that even if he doesn't win tonight, he can have a path after tonight. What path is that? 